4,000 new subscribers in two and a half months. How I did it. <laughs>
and yet I've given focus to YouTube. And so when I came over here and gave focus, I began to tag my videos and that I find that that is very, very, very important. I began to decide what my titles would be. That's probably number one key. If you notice in the very beginning of my videos, I normally address the topic, you know, whatever it happens to be, because the first few words from my understanding count a lot in how um, YouTube promotes your channel. And then I began to go over to other people's channels and become friends over there. And often they ask me to be on a panel with them. And so recently I've begun to do that and that's accelerated um, my, uh, the, the people that has come to my channel. So I think the key to it is making quality videos. I believe that I make quality videos because I'm authentic and I let you all see who I am. I let you see into my world to some degree and I have my own, um, my own style. You know, mine's from grandma's porch. Yours might be something totally different. And because I have a grand, I had a grandma who was wonderful and I grew up with her. Um, and, uh, uh, so I decided to kind of make it more like who I am, like you're coming to visit my home and I'm grandma and I'm sitting out on the porch talking to you and we're just having a good time. And that's kind of what my channel is. Your channel may be something totally different because you, you remember you want to be authentic and you want to be who you are. You can't be who I am because there's only one me and I can't be who you are because there's only one you. I think where people go wrong is they try to be a copy of someone else and I'm not. I'm just me. I don't go to other people's channels and say, oh, I want to be like them. No, I want to just be the best me that I know how to be. So I think that comes across too. I'm very nice. I'm very polite when I go to other people's channels. I stay away from some topics which are like politics. Now, some people do politics and it works really, really well for them. That's not my lane in life. I stay in my own lane, which is wisdom and insights. And some people, uh, their lane is politics. Now, if I get over in their lane, I'm going to get whacked. So I stay in my lane and vice versa. And so I think it's important to stay in your lane and work with what's right for you. And so that's what I do. And, um, you know, like I said, I go to other people's channels. I comment, I watch their videos. I go on live stream with them, you know, so that it's like a panel discussion and that will really enhance a viewership. And, um, yeah, I mean, I think 4,000 new friends, oh, my door just shut, <laughs> the wind blew. Um, I think 4,000 new people, new friends in two and a half months is pretty incredible, at least for me. Uh, maybe not for someone else, but for me. But there again, it's about quality. It's about being your authentic self, your authentic look, your authentic way of speaking, your authentic style, your, um, your, just your authenticity, delivering a great product, so to speak. And, um, let's see, tagging titles, um, and, you know, maybe having a little introduction or so about who you're about, because like mine is Grandma's Porch. And um, I think that's it, you know, and just keep out there every day. I've always believed that when you get focused to something, you can almost achieve anything that you want in life when you give it focus. And so the last two and a half months, I've given my YouTube channel focus. And so I thank you all for being a part of my channel and letting me be a part of your channels. I thank you so very much. I'm very humbled and I'm very uh, grateful to each and every one of you. And I'm getting to know all of you. You know, it's kind of hard for me sometimes to go back and comment. I do comment on everyone's postings and I do go back to your channels and I try to comment and I try to watch a video if at all possible. Um, being that I have, you know, suddenly 4,000 new friends, uh, sometimes I can't always keep up the pace and sometimes it takes me a day or two to get back to you, but I do. Okay, I do. Well, from my house to yours, may God bless you. From Grandma's porch to wherever you are at, um, I'll talk to you soon. May God bless you and have a wonderful, wonderful day. I'll talk to you then. Bye-bye.